So welcome everyone. I'm so delighted to be here in uh, the Shawville area of Quebec. Um, I'm Regemd Escandone from The Antidote and our guest today is Verdania Swami Tierra. Namaste Rangan. Namaste. I'm so delighted to be sitting here with her. Uh, Verdania is someone that I have known for 25 years um, and have had the honor of studying with. And I just wanted to formally introduce her because uh, she's a woman of so many talents. She's definitely someone who has studied her entire life. Um, and uh, it's something I witness still. She's always continuously learning, which has definitely been an inspiration for me um, and for many around her. So early on in life, she studied and has a bachelor's, if I understand correctly, in psychology. In psychology. Um, she later has studied, uh, is certified Kundalini teacher, Hatha teacher, Yoga Nidra. She's done Vedic studies. She has, um, is a master in Ayurveda as well. Um, and I would say, well, and she's an artist. She's an author of multiple books, uh, and she's a mother of two incredible young men, uh, to name a few of her qualifications. And, uh, but I would say her most important body of work is her 45 years of teaching and actually having that experience of working with students around the world of many different cultural backgrounds um, I've always really appreciated that you bring together so many different uh, traditions of learning. It's very eclectic in some ways. Um, and I definitely appreciate the uh, uh, shamanic work, the shamanic studies that you did in South America, your apprenticeship for two years in the jungle. Uh, so very South American flavor, but she's lived in North America for all these years. So you kind of bring all that to the table. So, and uh, what I wanted to speak to you today and learn a little bit more about is your YouTube channel, Verdania Teachings. Uh, and I'd like to learn a little bit more about your inspiration for starting it and what it is we can find on that channel. Um, thank you, Ranjan. Um, yes, the channel was born in 2010, and I was not really focused on it until lately. Um, but the inspiration is to bring a resume of little lessons that are in the teachings, so little highlights that were part of a larger body of work and different retreats and different pilgrimage or simply just sharing with people uh, things that I consider an upgrade of information, especially for the feminine aspect. So the, the channel have that first intention is two things, is one to empower the inner self, which is the feminine. It's not a gender what I'm talking about. Yeah. It's to empower the inner self and to do it in a way that is simple and reachable. And second is to send messages that are the foundation for self-liberation or inner uh, realization. So with this tool, they are created a different playlist that people can select each month. There's the first main list, which is the Verdania teachings, that touch on different topics of every week. Um, that mirrors the playlist of the Spanish part, which I also feed. Then there, I put a uh, monthly practice in the tools for well-being. So people can also practice for a month certain pranantology um, sequences 
related to the theme of the month. We have tips in Ayurveda uh, as well. We have um, parts on interviews like you, interview with remarkable people. And since I uh, travel a lot, and as you know, I have um, Earth Light Workers community. So we put different uh, inputs of the Earth energies and journeys and ceremonies that we do in different parts of the world as well. So that's a, a beautiful playlist that people can tap into it. The Living to on Earth series. Living on Earth it's series. beautiful. To know what is your land, where are you born from, because you are your Earth, you are part of that. So, to know the different uh, aspects of, of the of Gaia, the feminine as well. And there are other playlists uh, about art, meditation, and mind. So, those are the, the parts where you can find videos that are fed depending of the, of the theme. There is other playlists that are specifically for certain explorations, like the relationship uh, um, playlist or the section in detachment or the section in meditation and so on. So it's a, it's a repertoire that mirrors the school, the evolution school, the mystic school that I founded three years ago with the intention really to support more deeply the teachings, where you're not only being in YouTube with certain frequency and, you know, you are in the end of the day and you are just, okay, let's see what is up there. You're kind of brain dead at that point. In evolution, you have the opportunity to reprogram yourself with a very specific uh, course and a very specific uh, way of commitment to yourself, where you have deeper practices tailored to yourself and so on. So the, the YouTube um, mirrors that, uh, the activities in the school, the courses, and as well the different uh, clips of clips of teachings that we do in our journeys. So it's a, it's a fabulous platform, and uh, I'm so happy to help and inspire women especially to be more themselves and to find a place of at ease with that power that have been lost and abused and misunderstood. And I think at this point in development of the earth and development of humanity, if women don't give birth to herself and don't give to birth to a new civilization, then we are just repeating a loop of uh, the same thing, you know, repeating the same patterns and advancing in a very small way. So right now, it's, it's women are looking, and and I say women and also males to the feminine, the feminine is it's looking a, yeah the feminine is looking the the life force the receptivity mm -hmm. where you're not only in the action mode but you're also in the receptive mm, acknowledging your feelings your inner knowing and that create individuals a strong secure individuals and that is the the inspiration for me to to place every week something that make you think about it. What mm -hmm. is it you are doing about it and how you are relating to your own force, to your own power. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. And you know, my experience has been that, you know, what what you offer in the planetology, breath ontology sequences is very, very unique. It has the breath work, it has the meditation, but the way you tailor it to each topic for the reprogramming is very, very unique. Yeah, the, each person is, is our universe. 
and each universe have a trajectory of um, experiences and opportunities and awareness and consciousness. So as they are common things, like we all breathe, we all can pay attention to something, we all can put intentions on something, but they are also in the planetology sessions is, is tailored to how you're breathing your life and how you're excelling, how you're letting go. Mm-hmm. And in that you have your own cycle, you have your own formula, your own chemistry. Mm-hmm. And that is the, the art and science of planetology mm-hmm. uh, where, where you are really looking into the depths of your own life, which is the breath. Mm-hmm. And that's why I say the, the, the videos, the lessons stimulate yeah. you breathing differently because you are listening to it. And there are some parts that poke you, mm-hmm. right? Some parts that say, okay, you take notes yeah. and make your homework and you will see what you consider your boo-boos, yeah. what you have not forgive about yourself. What is your next step, and so on. So each yeah. lesson have kind of a homework that you can go deeper yourself if you wish. Then, yeah. but in a way, it's changing your breath. It's changing the way that you're perceiving mm-hmm. your life mm-hmm. and your life flow. Mm-hmm. So it's um, yeah, it's part of that. And to to reach all over the world, you know, it's um, YouTube is in that sense is a is a great platform where it match the agility of our times where the time is and the space is closer and faster and I still can live in my woods. <laughs> um, north or south. North or south. <laughs> east or west. East or west, yes. It's, it's wonderful, you know, to spend time in the north and spend time in the south and in India to have different residences uh, unite me as well through the channel so I can uh, be anywhere and reach all of you. So my experience of that is, is I feel a real cross fertilization of all these different areas. So when you're in the South and teaching from the South, there's an energy of the South that comes forward. And it's something to me that um, makes the whole experience and investigation richer and um, you know helps give me different flavors inside of myself that maybe I didn't have as well. Yeah the body is uh, like a radio station so you tune in depending on where you are and that's one of something I born with right I born with the ability to see the energies, the, to feel the energies, and to tune in with where I am and to who is in front of me. That's why the readings and the entunement is universal. And it's part of the feminine to be able to trust that and develop that. So whatever I am, I am. that's why I'm filming outside most of the time, to give you a kind of a flavor of the land that I am walking on if I am in Morocco okay there will be noises and stuff but it's part of what people in that land is adapting and, and going through and the vibration is a little bit more alive so I don't want to say I am a, a travel channel but it still is you know you, you are receiving the energy from different places and that's that's wonderful yeah yes and one of the ways that that cross fertilization can also happen is through questions, right? That um, one of the things that um, we do that I've done over the years is pose a question, and next thing I know, there's a video made about my question, not necessarily naming me or um, but speaking towards it, and often in a way that. Sometimes it's hard for me to know if it's she's answering my question. Sometimes I really know she, you're answering my question. 
and that's something that um, you know there's the opportunity now as people um, respond to your YouTube channel to ask questions. More of that is is um, they create their own community by sharing where they are at. Yes. So the collective uh, consciousness that is alive in YouTube <coughs> um, reflect the human preoccupation, investigation, contemplation, yes. needs, lacks. So it's not like I respond to that. I, re I am responding to the collective needs. I'm responding to what is in the air in the planet and animating that. And everybody is informed. And that's, again, part of the feminine capability mm -hmm. to know what is going on in the planet. And because you individually are experiencing expressing uh, your own uniqueness in responding to that and yes. that makes the collective richer and, yes. and, and whole, it unite us and that's why I say even if I don't respond to, you, to your question, you are expressing the, the collective insights Yes, and, and other women there say, yeah, I think the same, yes, that's what I need and so on. So it, it, it creates a cyber community uh, that is impersonal mm -hmm. and and we are not you know close friends going for a tea but we are feeling each other in the web and feeding the web with a frequency that is needed mm -hmm. that we're choosing to animate so mm -hmm. it's, it's not a simple thing the question and answer it have a great repercussions in the community Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. So it's, it's, it's great to receive all those uh, comments and questions and insights. Yeah, and both the questions and the comments have a resonance that informs and forms us. So, yeah. you yeah. know, both are so valuable to see there. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it reflects what we're going through and what we're looking for. And that each of have a wisdom to share. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm just stimulating through the channel. Yes. But is uh, each woman have something to say, something to share, is uh, a point of view that is is unique to them and is contributing to the collective enrichment and development. Yes. Yes. Badanya Swami Tiara, thank you so much for sitting with me with your undivided attention. <laughs> <laughs> And thank you for joining us. I'm very excited to uh, see your interactions with Verdania over the days and months to come and for it to form and inform me. So thank you so much for being with us and thank you for much for being with me today. Namaste. Yeah, namaste. Thank you.